All right, folks, welcome back to Shovel Knight, King of Cards. We are now in the final area, Birder Bluffs, and we <laughs> went on a very long wild goose chase to capture Polar Knight. And now, honestly, my goal for this episode, I want to get to the next Joustus house. So, we've unlocked this over here. Here we go. We already have it. The Crag of Joustus. Let's head on over. Okay, nothing over there. Uh, you've got creepy eyes. Old lady, this house of Joustus has been here for ages, but this statue of King Birder, well, that's new. I ain't ever seen him, but apparently he's the third Joustus judge. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I forgot I had actually unlocked the next Joustus house. That would be a disappointing way to end the stream. It's Leo! I heard there's a fancy shop nearby, but where is it? I can't be <laughs> sartorially superior if I'm not clad in coucher. Speaking of superiority, care to play Joustus? I'm quite good. <laughs> Let's enjoy a round or two before I continue pacing about this cabin unimpressed. You, he seems like a fun guy to invite the parties. King Knight versus Leo. Okay, he can't push my guys to the, uh, down. Cool. If that's the game. Oh, well, he can push me up there. I'd rather him he not push me up, but I don't think that's going to be an option. He's going to push me up. Oh, no, he's not! Well, lucky me. Alright, I gotta get back into Joustus. Oh, you crud butt. Okay, I gotta think. If I do that, he can still... Nope, then he can push me up. But then I can... He can push me up, but then I can push him to the... Mm, no, that, that'll actually work. Go on, push me up, I dare you. And so you shall perish. Okay, hang on. I, I don't want him to be able to push me up again, though. No. Hmm. If I do this, does it switch over? No, it doesn't. And if I do that, it'll switch over. Okay, no, we don't want that. I will do that, though. See, that's what I thought he was going to do. I do not want him to keep pushing me up, though. Because if I do this, he's just going to push... How many of those stupid night guys does he have? This is ridiculous. Oh, that's how you're gonna play, eh? Why can't I push anything up now? Ah! Hey, Mobius, it goes terribly. I am really freaking bad at this stupid card game. Like, really bad at it. Cool, I won it regardless. <laughs> King Knight wins! Alright, what do we have here? Torpedo? No, I don't think so. I will get Big Bodo. Ha 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 Well played! It's it's a built-in card game. And it's it's called Joustice. It's really hard. Blowing fruits! A uh, fan of the latest delivery of Joustus decks. Big fan. Oh no, it's the stupid fat guy that always pushes me off a cliff. It's the rookie! The King Birder statue so powerfully cool looking. Whoever made that statue is a really good artist. Old lady again. 
Don't you love the birder bluffs? When I was a girl, there weren't nearly as many birders as today. I don't know if I love the birder bluffs. I guess they're okay. All right, my dude. Hey, your highness. Why not have a look here? Uh, I'm gonna save my money, I think. Oh, hey! It's... it's a toter back again. Hey, hey, puppy dog. The young pup has awoken! Are we ready to play? No? Yes? Barf, barf. It seems that the spin wolves only play as a trio. Okay, well, there's three of them. Hop over to our pad and lend us an ear- or no, it's the Kermit voice, sorry. Uh, hop over to our pad and lend us an ear hole. What are we gonna do about this puzzle? Sorry, I- I don't know. Ugh, maybe she should just solve it. Another justice puzzle, eh? That's a lot of cards. Win the game in one turn. Okay? Interesting. Nobody has any gems. In order to get gems, he's gonna have to push somebody... Wait. He's gonna have to push somebody to the... Wait. Oh, I see. So if I do that... He could push that guy back down, so that wouldn't work. If I do that, he can't push him back down, he can't push him to the left, he can't push him to the right, and he can't push him up. And I don't think he can push anybody else in any direction, so there we go. Alright, well that was easy. That was a lot easier than the puzzles in the last Justice House. Nice! You solved it! I'm green with envy! Your skills are so fly, you've got me tongue-tied! We overheard the champion down below. They had quite a husky voice. It's hard to convey how rough this puzzle is. Want to try wolfing it down? Okay, Kermit. <laughs> These puns are delightful. Okay, so he has one gem, and we gotta win the game in one turn. So this might be another case where we have to force him to push one of our guys into the gem on his turn. Alright, interesting. Oh no, we might have to take advantage of the arrow guy. So if we do... Oh, that's weird. Oh, there are the conveyor belts that make you move after... Oh, I forgot about that. This is where justice gets just really complicated. Ugh. Okay, wow, that's, that's a lot. Okay, if we do that... Actually, that might be it. Yeah! Cool! I prefer Uno to Old Maid. But, I mean, I'm talking about real Uno, not that stupid fake Uno that they have on Steam. Where it's like, oh, you played a Zero, everyone swaps hands. It's like, that is not Uno. That is a completely different game that you are playing with the Uno deck. Oh, we treasure your help on this last one! It's Gildar Enthusiasm! Truly, we're gem-boozled! Cascade arrows make my cards and head spin, but you can try it. Okay... Yikes. So what does the Cascade card do? Ah, uh, it flips it over. Great. Oh! Well, no wonder this guy hates this puzzle. I hate it too. Okay, so if we do that... Wait, hang on. If we do that, can't he just... Wait, isn't that just the solution? Oh, what? He flipped the card over to him. What? The crap? That's... How is that... Why would you ever want those cards in your deck? You wouldn't. Okay. Well, that's gonna make things kind of dumb. Okay, if we do that... Nope, then he's gonna grab himself two gems. 
Torpedo, though. If we do that, nope, then again, he... Okay, I mean... Oh, do we just do that, and then he doesn't actually flip our card over? Wait! He... But that... My card wasn't that type! I do... I don't understand Joustus, even after multiple playthroughs of King of Cards. So if you've got the propeller icon, when you push a card around, it turns that card into your card. Is that how it works? What if we push our own card? No, if... Okay, it just flips it to the opposite color. So maybe the solution is, if we do that, it flips it over to his, and then he has to flip it back over to ours. That is, um... I don't like that, but at least we solved it. Wow, truth be told, we knew you'd swim through this webbing of puzzles. Take this, chum! What do we get? Fish head! Oh boy, it's a Cascade card, and it's a Conveyor Belt card. Oh boy. Hey dude, it's the Cogslaughter! After a long day in the factory, aww, oh, this breathtaking panorama. It's all the fulfillment I need, but I suppose you're here for a match, eh? Yes! The gears of life never stop turning even for a moment. You gotta enjoy it. Well, hopefully now that I understand some of these weird cards, I can do a bit better. Enjoy your dinner, Proxima. Ooh. I think that's a good move. Get off the table! Okay. <laughs> I love that move. That's fine. I'll take I'll just take a win. I don't need a clean sweep. I just would like a win. <laughs> All right. We can get Toad's Drake, Clockameleon, Electrodent. Okay. Uh let's take Toad's Drake? Yeah, Toad's Drake. Seems like a good card. Doesn't have any of this needlessly complicated stuff. It's Yoppler! Horns, the finest instrument, but they only really come to life in a duet? Metaphorically, I mean. Well, I got a horn. Now he's making that little tornado. So if we can spin into it... Hover me! Oh, wee! You're my fan! <laughs> I'm a fan of Joustus! Sorry, we'll battle, yes? Wee! Are you a fan of battle? Yep. Are you light enough? Can you teeter? Let's teeter on the edge! Alright, Hover Meanie. That's an, a fitting name for you. Because you were quite a meanie in my previous playthroughs. Cane Knight versus the Hovamini. Oh, how grand. Okay. Ooh, at this p Well, hang on. I don't want him to be able to push me down, actually. Oh, you dirty rat. Then he can push me to the right again.
I do not want him to push me to the right. can't push him to the right. Ugh! This is not good. Oh wait, he can't push me to the right. Because that guy is... Mm. Okay, at least I can get that gem back. If I do that, he can't push me up, but he could push me to the right. We don't want that. Okay, now just checking, he can't move me off of that? He can't move me up? Yes! Cool. Oh, if only... Wait, I can move his fan... Oh, I... I can move that, but I don't think I want to nest... Well... I mean, again, I don't really need the clean sweep. So, we'll just take the victory. Oh, hey, look! We can get Hover Meanie! <laughs> Yeah, that was mean of you to try to take my cards. Spin as a spin, spin! Into the secret passageway. Hey, it's Oolong! Ugh! That was gross. I wonder what Justice card we get. Will it possibly be? Oh, it's Yoppler! I guess that makes sense. Do we get Oolong over here? No, we just get money. <laughs> hey, Oolong. Ah, my head! Forget musics! What Oolong do now? Relax, Oolong. A full brain is a sad brain. I never think about anything, and I'm totally happy! Ah, uh, head empty. Serene. Brain tube flow is okay. Maybe not so bad. Thank you, God Knight. We music together soon, if Oolong remember. Exactly. That's a cool little puzzle. I like that. Oh, it's the minion! According to my notes, the monster I'm researching is near. He looks like this. Have you seen him? Um, what does he look like? Oh, it's Ulam! <laughs> oh, no, I, I'm sure he'll turn up. I'm sure he's fine. Those really do look like you can you should be able to break it open, but I guess not. Oh, the torn. The doggos are ready to play. Yes, they are. Good boys! Is everyone awake now? I beat the other justice players. I'm top dog here. Rock, 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 rock! Seems that the Spin Wolves are ready to play Joustice. <laughs> Alright. They're dogs, how hard could they be? Famous last words. Oh no! Boss power, dig it. Hey! You just got out. Oh, I see how you're. No, really? Is that so? Okay, we gotta be smart about this. Because if I push the Miscenter Gem up, they could push me back down. But. Well! Actually, I guess it would depend. 
If I do that... Oh, he can't even push... So he can't push me up, he can't push me down, or he can push me to the right, except he doesn't have a card that can do that. That's what we do. Okay, I'll think you're clever, huh? If so, if we do that, he could push me... Okay, he could push me up to take the gem. So I'd rather he not do that. Okay, if I do that... Oh, is that how you're gonna play it? He really does not want me to get... Th just let me have it, man. Come on, just let me have it. Okay, if I do that, he still can't push me to... Oh, he's gonna dig up his own thing. Is okay. Interesting. Why do I? Why can't I push stuff up now? I would really like to be able to push stuff up right now. Oh well. Uh, if I do that as King Knight, he can't push me. Oh yeah, that's just great. <laughs> so he's gonna dig his own thing out. Okay. What? Okay, I call bias. The gems are always landing on his own stuff. Okay, so if I do that, he's gonna push me... Ah, no matter what he does, I can just push him up. Oh, wait, I don't have anything that can push up. Okay, we're getting you off that. No, oh, I can't! Why can't I push stuff up? Okay, if I push you, can I kill you? No, I can't. And if I do that, he'll he can push me. Hmm. I'm gonna play the patient game for that one. Okay, so he's gonna do it that way. Well, I guess this means I can win. If I do that, ye oh yes, cool. Take that gem back, then he'll probably fill up the final spot. He won't. Clean sweep. <laughs> oh, wonderful. Okay, well, I will definitely be taking the Cinder Wolf because I don't have that. I will also take the Memic. I don't think I have that. I'm pretty sure I already have a Birder, but we're gra gonna grab another one anyways. Bark! 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 Good pups! Wanna go for a walk? Do you wanna go for a ride? Just bite my cape when I jump up! Bark! 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 Come on, grab on, my boys! Yay! We got a dog. Actually, we got three dogs. <laughs> Mom, can we have a dog? No. Alright, we'll get three of them. She only objected to getting a single dog. Not multiple. Look, Mom, aren't you so proud of me? Oh, my little lamb, you must hear some of King Pride Moore's stories. What a fascinating life he's led. Oh, I'm nothing without an audience, and it's rare that anyone shows interest. Your mother is simply lovely. No, 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 no! Be silent! Sweetie, have you brought some koi? <laughs> Bob, I still can't believe you're making me pay for your pies. I don't find it hard to believe. Now, all done. Keep upgrading, my God. Okay, we got all the upgrades. <laughs> Yay! Stem's alive. I was worried so about the Tropical King flying, but what a view! Can I play Joustus against you? No, I cannot. The Baz is still here. Well, gee, at this point, if we've just got cash to burn, I guess we might as well buy some more Joustus cards. Let's keep buying the level 1 mystery cards just to round out the collection. 
It's the ruffian! Zambi! I already have Zambi! Oh man, they keep giving me repeat cards. It's just like McDonald's Monopoly. Wait, I didn't have Torpedo? Really? I thought I had like an infinite amount of them. Hedge Farmer! Yay! I'm just buying weak cards. Tadville, yuck. Zambi again? Can I sell you my old cards that I don't want anymore? <laughs> Terror Pin! There he is! We still need the Black Knight. I don't know if he, we can only get him from the Black Knight or not, though. I'm gonna regret trying to get every single card, aren't I? We didn't have a fairy? How? How did we not have a fairy? Please, I really need the Black Knight. And actually, maybe he's level two. I'm assuming I can get all the cards from this guy. But I'm getting a lot of repeats now. I'm blowing so much cash on Pokemon cards. Sumo Gold Armor! There we go! Okay, we got 100% now. Let's buy a level 3 mystery card then. It's the Gold Dome! Oh, actually, wait. Oh, we can buy a level 2 as well. Oh, I already have two burgers. Rats. Well, now we can actually do some gameplay. <laughs> instead of just the Joust discards. Alright, let's go to the Clockwork Tower. Shock Assembly. Reign of Decadence. Oh. I thought that was going to be something that I could, like... <laughs> okay, so if you step on the switch, then it sparks. Oh, but really good music. Out of my way! Okay, now these... Okay, I don't have to physically touch those. Oh no, the other guy is physically t- Aha! Uh -huh. Aha! Uh -huh. <laughs> Quite an interesting gimmick. I do think the mystery cards you buy... I actually think they do have a bias towards giving you ones you don't have. It's not a guarantee, but considering how many cards there are, we definitely got the remaining cards without too much difficulty. Because I know some things are not nearly as kind with regards to that. Like again, McDonald's Monopoly. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so sad I keep taking damage. <laughs> Darn it. I cried at the wrong time. Crying is for special occasions, like funerals or if you're playing Clannad After Story. This song is so good. Ha <laughs> ha! Thank you, Magnet Boots. 
Oh boy, it's the Decree of Soaring. A single-use item, summon a friendly birder to carry you over pits and obstacles for 35 seconds. Oh. The decrees are kind of useless to me. I don't like using them. Because I can only carry so many. Conveyor belt pushed me that. Well, that's just not very nice. All right, here we go. If something is useful, but in finite supply, I never use it. Mainly just, I always forget about the decrees. Because they don't appear on the quick swap menu. Ha ha! Huzzah! Alright, we got the shock therapy. How wonderful. Oh, it's Tinker Knight! Would you like to join my crew, Tinker Knight? Yeah! Who are you? Are you friend or foe? Ah! Oh, I'm just passing through this abandoned house! Are you a ghost? I've seen so many ghosts lately. I'm no ghost, but I am a fool. I tried to make men from brass and tin. This time I went too far. Now they have a mind of their own. I thought they would fight for me, but in the end I hide here. Are you here to take them? No, I can't let you use them! Leave now! Alright. You didn't think I forgot about the flame saber now, did you? Boom! Ah, here it comes. Well, rip Tinker Knight's house. On the run! Oh dear! <laughs> no! My throne! You'll pay for this, Tinker Knight! <laughs> when I'm keen, I won't be inviting you to my fancy banquets anymore. Thank you, my rat friends! Boom! <laughs> Bow before your keen. All right, now we can go to the fancy shop. Always check back at the start. <laughs> you never know. Now that shop looks sure familiar, don't it? Oh, hello! Oh, a gold-clad guest! With platinum panache! How lovely! Welcome to my fancy shop! I sell only the fanciest fashions! Clearly you're in the right place! Look at that hat! It's positively regal! 
This is a crown, not a hat. Do you know what that makes me? Delightfully modest. <laughs> a peek at my noblest wares, may I? Yes, uh, bleh. Display overall. Give your interface some regal flair. The very height of your status. Silver plating, a professional design, <laughs> refits the Glidewing to better suit you. Your justice cards will receive fancier backs. The fronts change a little, too. Um, that's a little bit out of my price range for today, sir. Just know I'm a keen. So, uh, you'll have to lower your price for me. Peon! Sir, I implore you to make a purchase! I don't think you can, no. Is there nothing that suits you? Come back! I was so looking forward to trying on a new hat! End of the line, you tight-fisted curmudgeon! I'll have your hat if it's the last thing I do! Alright, bro. I do love the red beret you have, sir. Ooh, a new attack. Oh no, he pulled the Master Sword! And he got full HP from that. Ooh, bringing out the red carpet for your highness. Ooh, how one- Ooh! I love your attacks. So grand. Ooh, is that a horse? A true king doesn't need a horse. Boom! Now bow to me, Mr. Hat, if that's even your real name. Enough! I know not what came over me. Your hat, I can't look away. It shines and glimmers maddeningly. Just a bit of cabin fever, really. It's hard to make a friend or a sail in such a remote location. Well, that's all very interesting, but I'd better get going. I'll do anything for passage on your airship to escape this dead location. Here, let me mend your rope. Exactly! <laughs> Here I am, hat in hand with a new locale. My fancy shop is about to move on and up. Fine, fine, just get on with it. Let's go. You're starting to give me a crown ache. I freaking love Mr. Hat, man. <laughs> He's bringing the whole store with him. Man, those are some strong rats. <laughs> oh my thanks to this new location. It simply gleams with rustic potential. As for appointments, you're fancy enough to not need one. And I've lowered my prices just for now. <laughs> Gotta have those. Gotta have those. Thank you, Mr. Hat. Thank you so much. <laughs> it's, it's over here. <laughs> <laughs> what do you guys have to say about this? Ah, so I get this win. He doesn't have anything to say about the hat store. Stand. Welcome to the Grand Gallery, Gallery Gala. The whole shop's discounted, but my exhibition is a limited edition. My impractical wares makes everything fancy. Prepare to be dazzled. It's still a little out of my price range, but I swear I will actually buy them this time when I get enough money. Hey, Tinker Knight. When I left, men of tin swept through the halls of my proud home. I plan to build parts out of their scraps. But first, I have time to play a match or two. Alright, Tinker Knight, let's go. King Knight versus Tinker Knight. Yay, he gets to go first. Okay. Hooty hoot. I thought you would do something like that. Holy holes, Batman. What the heck? The conveyor belt stuff is just nuts to me.
Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, that's how you want to... Oh, that's how you want to play, eh? Is that how you want to play? You know, if I could get something that could push... Oh, that's actually... That's not good. No, that's not good at all. If I do that, I can't get pushed down. Okay, now if I do that... Yeah, okay, wait. He could still push... No, he can't, because he can't push down right now. Okay, well, I cannot let him... Cannot let him get this. Hmm, but if I... Okay. I don't want to end up stalemating. I do... Mm, I don't... Okay, if I do that, he could push me off the... Mm. Darn, no, I don't want to do that, because then he cements himself as having that gem. Is that... That might be the only thing I can do, though. I guess I could also do that. Actually, if I do that, he might just be... Well, hang on. He still can't push things down. So actually, yeah, that might just stalemate us. Yeah. I wasn't going to win that one, so I'm just going to make sure he can't win. Yeah, let's rematch. I know I probably should edit my Joustice deck a bit, but nah. Oh, I definitely should out edit my Joustice deck. Why is Croker still in my deck? <laughs> Okay, we got Tinker Knight in the batch, eh? Yeah, you can stay there. That's fine by me. You can stay there. He just keeps pushing my stuff off. Thank you. That gem is mine forever. And if I can get Phantom Striker down on that other gem, that'll also be mine forever. I want him to push his rat down. I hope he does push his rat down, because then I can push him away with Phantom Striker, and... Well, actually, hmm... I can always do that later, but but at that point, if he has something that can... Okay, no, I'll, I'll, I'll hold off on that until later. I don't know, uh... I think I've got this, probably? But you never know for sure. I just don't want him to get the center gem. That's what I'm worried about right now. Uh, 
yeah, because I don't want him to put something down there. I want him to fill in that gap over there. So I guess in the meantime... That works for me. There, you have to push me in the center. Shoot! Wasn't paying attention. Oh wait, no, never mind. Okay, if we do that, we just need to make sure he can't push me to the right. Which right now he cannot. Cool, and then we win. And then I need to change out my Justice deck. <laughs> Eventually. Um, Tinker Knight, where are you? You were on the board for... Tinker Knight himself was... Oh no, he got filled in. Oh no, that stinks. Uh, I guess I'll get the Cog Slaughter. Because Tinker Knight himself was on the board, but then he filled in the black hole and disappeared forever. Boo. Oh, but that did give us enough to buy something from Mr. Hat. My friends, do you this? Okay. Uh, we can get the Golden Hearts. We can get the Glidewing design. Or the Joust. You know, let's get the Gilded Joustus deck. I think that's just so fitting. And speaking of Golden Joustus decks. Okay. Yeah, you're out of here. 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 I know my deck's not complete. What of it? I missed the part where that's my problem. Okay, uh, Yoppler. He can swap. Okay, that actually could be useful. I don't want too many of those cards, but that one will be useful. <laughs> the Hoop Kid. Okay, do I have anything like better than stuff around here. We got birders! I don't really want the, the swap stuff, either. I'll get Goldome, though. Big Beetle could be nice. And I'll get the... the Hopefully that'll make my Justice games a little bit better. Or they can make my Justice games a little bit worse. You just never know. And <laughs> now it's just a Void Crater. Okay, we skipped a lot of stuff at the beginning. Let's go back to the Flying Machine, the Aerial Brigade. Shine your crown! Well, the flying machine, I think, is going to be obnoxious. Like it was in all the stories. But we'll make do with it. Um, you're describing an airplane. So far, so good. We got no auto scores, and we got no wind physics. Congratulations, you just described something that literally everybody knew. Yeah, that screamed that there was a secret up there. Checkpoint? Oh, maybe not yet.
there. That's what I was trying to do. Oh, you think you can hide that from me, but I see that. Secret exit. Secret exit. It's this way. Oh, doggone it. I'm like, oh, it's a good thing there are no auto scores. Then I, I say the words, and then all of a sudden, auto scores. Exit. Wow. But we gotta go there and uh, finish what we started. Back, back again. <laughs> the greatest king who ever lived is coming through. And I don't mean Mufasa. Now we get to play the fun game of Did I Miss a Merit Medal somewhere along the way? Is that like the Harry Potter fan fiction? <laughs> I love how I can grab the same treasure again. Because the treasure gremlins that keep putting money in the chests after I leave. Such kindness. If only the treasure gremlins could put something other than potions in the chests in Kingdom Hearts. That would be nice. Fan fiction does not really appeal to me. I'd rather tell an original story. the same reason where, like, I debated making a, a mod of a di an existing visual novel that I played, but I'm like, wait, it would be much better to just make an original visual novel. I mean, yeah, I'd have to get all the artwork and music done, which would be time-consuming, but it allows for more creativity. And then you'll have something that's uniquely yours. something I would like to do, it's just, it's not easy. Anything beyond the actual text itself is uh, going to require probably hiring somebody. Yes, this is what we're doing. Huzzah! 
and all the merit medals, too. Wonderful. Ooh, the gold chest in the Lover's Vista. Uh... Bubble Frog, I think we're gonna need you. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Never mind, Bubble Frog. Thanks. But I got it. Oh? What's in this beautiful red chest? <gasps> oh, it's the true love's rose! Who locks up a rose? It must be meaningful to someone. Let's take it! <laughs> Meanwhile, the beast is like, Where is the rose? No! That seems strange. The card chest! The king's roost? Hello, my good sir. That old hag must have been wrong. King Birder isn't here. He probably isn't even real. How can anyone bag the Joustus crown if they can't even find the Joustus judges? Take this card, I'm done here. Is it yours? It's King Birder! How great. Level 3 mystery card. It's the Flounder. I don't like the level 3 mystery cards. They're too gimmicky. Electrodent! Glad I didn't grab that from Tinker Knight. Also, I still haven't played Specter Knight. Specter Knight has not appeared on my... Glidewing. Actually... Is Specter Knight wandering in the an earlier part of the map and I just never... Okay, I cleared every stage here. Spectre Knight is supposed... You, you're supposed to be able to play Spectre Knight, but I have not been able to play him yet. And he has not appeared on my Glidewing. Maybe he doesn't appear till later? That's what I'm gonna assume. Clockwork Tower, Torque Lift Torsion. The Battle Royale. Now we get the not-so-great Clock Tower music. Oh ho ho! Gotta grab the Merit Medal first. Bye bye. Haha! -ha! I didn't think so. This is apparently the round of the hidden exits. It's like we're back in Vanilla Dome. More forest of illusion. <gasps> No, I hate vertical auto screw, please. Haha. -ha. Who's shooting all these mini missiles at me? I would like to know who would dare attack royalty. When I'm a when I'm king, whoever's launching these is first to the guillotines. <laughs> Welcome back, Proxima. You probably came back at the mention of guillotines. Whoops.
Huzzah! But uh, we still gotta get the real exit. <laughs> so we can go back to the House of Justice that we've already grabbed. Do 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 Here we go. It's bonk time. Aha! Uh -huh. I love you, Flame Saber. Mmm, turkey. Out of here, Ratty. His Highness King Knight is coming through. It has neither the time nor patience to deal with nonsense. Give me my treasure! Ooh! Oh, we can art we can afford the next upgrade. From, uh, Sir Hat. Or Mr. Hat. Yeah! Thank you, my rat friends! In fact, you are so loyal to the, <laughs> to the nobility, to the monarchy, you are not even considered subjects, you are considered friends. <laughs> 